Hello GoKeys family, I wanted to alert you to a problem that has been reported by quite a number of users and it's to do with the speakers, okay? The report I keep getting is that for some people the speakers vibrate. So let's play a style. So I don't notice anything on my end. I'm going to try a different style. So the style that I was using, um, let's try a different one, uh, something harder. Let's go for rocking country. Full volume. I don't notice anything right now, but I do want to say that in some of the styles, if you crank it too high and then you're doing a full on vamp or jam, you could, in my case, I hear a little bit of vibration that is not there normally. So you're not hallucinating. It's possible you are experiencing that problem too. So the summary is this, right now I'm not experiencing any crackles. Sometimes, I want to say 5% to 10% of the time, I experience some vibrations on the speakers and I believe it's the woofer speaker over here. Now what is my recommendation? I recommend you use something like this. Over here you can see my Behringer keyboard amplifier. I've been using this for several years. I got this some years back um, at Guitar Center and this is a K450FX. This model may not be uh, sold um, uh, at Guitar Center or Amazon, even though it is listed on Amazon. You may find this particular model hard to get, but if you do find something in the K like 900FX or this family, you know, it's 4, 45 watt and it is very powerful. It gives me very good output. I would recommend using something like this. Roland also have their amps and, you know, any Yamaha does as well. So anything like this to amplify your sound is recommended. It will be unfortunate to have to return such a great keyboard as a result of the the poor speaker performance. So before you go return your keyboard, I want I want to advise maybe this is a better option. Alternatively, you could look for one of these Ions wireless speaker systems. It allows you to transmit via Bluetooth from your phone to something like this. But I also have a video showing how I use this along with another product to transmit wirelessly from my Go Keys. I will endeavor to put that in the comments. To transmit wirelessly from my Go Keys, I use this wireless G7 system. If you go to azexperiment.com, you'll find both the iron and this listed. And there's also a video showing how I get around it because there's just no point returning such a great keyboard as a result of puny little speakers. For some people, the speakers don't work well. For me, they actually work okay. I've actually jammed outside by a water fountain with it and people were able to hear, but I understand that there's some variation in these keyboard products and um, I don't expect everyone's keyboard to work as good as mine does. Okay, so if you're having trouble with your Go Keys and you know you need to get another speaker system to, to boost it, I would highly recommend that as opposed to just flat out returning it. Something else you could do is use really good speakers. As you can see here, I have this one audio system speakers. These are padded and extremely robust. Um, I now have a couple of these one audio and I've bought these one audios for a couple of friends and family because I truly believe in these speakers. 
uh, in these headphones. <laughs> what am I saying? You can get these one audio headphones also in my store, asiexperiment.com. You'll see where I have listed these. I strongly recommend them. They're really helpful. And it, it takes away the need for me to hear everything out of any of those speakers I just showed you, any of the amps I showed you. Because what I do um, most times is I just uh, put on the headphones so I can hear everything in stereo. And I route through USB audio to my laptop. So there are many ways around it, depending on what you want to do. But I want to um, encourage you to um, consider um, getting one of these systems in addition to what you have, as opposed to returning your keyboard. All right, my friends, take care and bye for now.